So this is the um, the Mayan god uh, Kukulkan. Um, I believe in the Incan or the Aztec, and it was called Quetzalcoatl, uh, 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 something like that. But it's Kukulkan in uh, in the Mayan, and he's the god of uh, creation. Um, it's a feathered serpent. Um, this is actually a really cool little. Uh, it's a, it's a it's a whistle type thing. Um, not whistle, but I'd say uh, it, it makes a sound that's that's similar to. Uh, to um to the wind i think it has a, it's a kind of windy sound kind of sound so i've played it a few times so let's give it a little done so um i just wanted to talk quick this is a post that i posted uh on facebook and i wanted to um, I, I guess it's like say it actually, because um, a lot of these things are transmissions from that I'm getting from, from you know from uh, my soul, my 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 true soul, and my other spirit guides, and these are, they're asking me to really say this, say this now, and record it. Um, it's important to understand. <coughs> so everybody knows 2012, right? December 21st, 2012 is the Mayan calendar ending date. Everybody was like, oh my God, what's going to happen? We're all going to float up into heaven or we're all, it's going to be great new energy and it's going to, it's going to be, it's all going to be good. And, and, but the, th the thing with it is, it doesn't work that way. You have to be prepared for this energy for it to be absorbed into the body. And, um, and while a lot of you, a lot of people got together and said, okay, this is what we're going to do. Yes, it's going to be with this new, new, it's the age of Aquarius type thing, new, new found energy that's going to lighten us and, and make us, you know, get away from this evil, greed, money driven madness, war, you know, land, land conquering. I mean, so it's, it's, it's all, it's all, and it's been happening for a long time now. Um, the mind, under the mind calendar, um, it's, it's, I think, 5,250. 5, 50 years and and there's another uh, there's a, the Kali, the Kali Yuga that's ending in the same date. Uh, Kali Yuga um, um, is well let let me, let me go back. I'm sorry. So so 2012 December 21st 2012 and and that was supposed to be the the, the Mayan, but it really wasn't. Um, it was um, because the civilizations have to be prepared for this. It, there's there's a, there's a testing period uh, uh, for for this new energy to come in. It's coming from the center of the uh, the galaxy actually. It's called the Hunan Group, and it's it's the galactic center uh, where where energy, new energies come into the planet to to, to bring people to another uh, you know the level of awareness uh, and the, and the the population. Now, the thing is, you have to be, it has to be prepared for it, and the the, the body has to be prepared for it. The, the things that you do as a civilization have to be prepared for this energy. If not, it's not really good. So I'll go into that later on, but. Um, so, so, so it was supposed to be December twenty first, twenty twelve. The only problem was that they they, they knew that that y'all wouldn't be ready for it. Um, so, so they they gave uh, an extra thirteen years uh, to that to that end date. Um, that thirteen years uh, represents in the Mayan um, in the Mayan culture. It's it's, it's 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 they follow the moon cycle. So they had a thirteen month calendar. So every month they would, you know, 28 days. Um, they would all, they would all, um, you know, basically everything would be followed by the perfection of the moon cycles. Uh, and women actually menstruated together under that, that day. And every month, they, you know, I didn't have to take pills to, you know, to, you know, to, to stop it or push, start it up or whatever it is y'all do. Um, um, so that perfection, 13 months. So the, the 13th is a very, very mystical. And it kind of, kind of goes in line with, you know, there was 12 disciples and one 13, 13, one, one the, the, supposedly the, Jesus was the, the, the spiritual one of the 13. So it's 13, you know, so 13 is a very mystical number. Um, the 13 full moons, you know, I don't know why the, this, the, this society chooses the Gregorian calendar of 12, 12 months, which is all like, you know, it's all mixed up. So 28 days is perfection. Um, oh yeah, it's to confuse the tribal cultures. That's what they do. Uh, so, so um, twenty twelve. Um, thirteen plus twelve. Twenty twelve is twenty twenty five, right? So, so instead of it being twenty, the, the, the this new this new cycle with energy going, instead of being December twenty first, twenty twelve, um, I, I'm being told, and I was told after actually uh, after that date, um, that um. The new end date is December twenty first, twenty twenty five, and that corresponds with something interesting. It corresponds with another another ending period. Uh, there's the ending period of Kali Yuga, 
in, in Hindu culture. That's where we are now. Kali Yuga is a period where, where greed, corruption, money-driven ego, madness, materialism, all the stuff that's happening, everything, almost everything that's happening here was, was dictated by the, by the Rishis, you know, many 5,000 years ago as being the period that we're in right now that's a very destructive period. And that goes along with, with the, 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 the Mayan calendar of 5,250 years of, of that same kind of like energy back and forth. Um, now, the end of Kali Yuga, now, one thing about the Kali Yuga, people go, no, 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 it is not, it is 260,000 years, we're in the middle, of somewhere in the world, only about 26,000 years. Yeah, it's 26,000 years, man. Not too, the the Rishis, they, they did it, they added the extra zero, some of them, I think, they, I mean, they actually did it because they didn't want to scare the shit out of you, <laughs> you know, uh, because, because that, that, and plus they were getting paid, you know, <laughs> by, by, by the, you know, caste system that existed in, in, in India at that time as well, so. Um, so the, 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 you have to understand that the, um, the ending of the Kali Yuga represents a new energy coming into this planet, same thing. Both the mind calendars that represent, uh, are talking about this new energy coming in. Um, we believe, okay, it's great. It's going to, what, do you think it's going to take the wealth class and you think it's going to take people that are charging you to live, take all the people that are profiting, all the evil people in this, in this, in this, in this civilization, all the people that are continuing this, 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 this civilization of like money hungry, money, you know, I don't, I don't even want to, I don't even, I, it, <laughs> you think that new energy is going to go into them and go, go oh yeah, we're going to change everything into everything you want now, now. Your, your civilization has to be prepared for that. I mean, mentally you have to be prepared to, to be able to, to, to take care of each other and the planet. Boom, boom, boom. Without, without anything else uh, dictating how, you know, how much of it, you know, equality based, equal, everything is equal. Um, if you're not prepared for it, then you got to be, uh, you can believe whatever you want to believe. What they've told me is, is, is something pretty destructive for your civilization. And I'm not going to go into it right now, but it is pretty destructive for your civilization. Uh, I've already talked about that um, in other videos, and but the, I'm just trying to stress the point that you know what, what was supposed to happen in 2012 is going to happen in 2025. And you know, y'all were somewhat prepared for it, but as soon as after that happened, like, we didn't we didn't float up into space, and the spaceships didn't come, so we're going to go back to work now. We went back to that same way, and that that is that was a miserable failure to the test of being able to accept this new energy. Because if you can't accept the new energy, then then you won't you, you won't your bodies won't able to handle it. Now, the ones that that can accept this energy, something else will happen. And I don't want again. I don't want to go into that right now. What I'm going into right now is is the fact that that um, you got two years left, 2025, and there's two two different cultures that are pointing to the same date, um, same date and time. Again, the, uh, the Hindu scholar, no, 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 it is 260,000 years. Why would, he, why would he put something on paper that was going to be, that you won't, your civilization, wouldn't, there's no way it could survive that long. <laughs> 260,000 years. 26,000 years. And your civilization wasn't there. It's, it's, it's regarding a, a, a solar cycle, a certain solar cycle that's coming too in 2025. Uh, that solar cycle is that long. And the Mayans knew about it, and the Hindus knew about it through the connections to, to other dimensional spirits that, that told them that. Um, and and based on what they needed to do, they needed to map out and present something out that would help the future generations. And you failed miserably again. Um, so um, all I can say is that good luck. Um, the, the energy is not going to be if you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing in civilization. It's not going to you know, extension type shit. So, um, but if you do. If you take our money, you start working together, to create these 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 these, these, these the equality based system. And it's real easy. Right now, you have a for profit system where there's a caste system, wealth, middle class, and 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 poverty. Right? There's no way that could be equality. Right? So push that away, and now you give build an equality based system. What's the word equality mean? Well, everybody is equal. Boom. Easy. Right? Easy to understand. Right? Everybody gets the same thing. Right? How do we go about doing that? Well, you got eight billion people that'll do it for you. If you don't what? If you don't rape half of them. So again, it's it's you gotta you gotta be ready for this energy in twenty twenty five. Because if not, as you're accepting it, you might just go boof. You think oh, oh shit, boof boof boof. Oh shit. Well, uh, uh, wait, uh, am I ready for it? Oh, I am good, good. But boof 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 boof. Oh shit. It's not this mass ascension thing. It's mass like get get rid of these things, man, because they they can't. They're not ready for anything else. They ain't got to this point. They ain't ready for anything else. 
Sorry to scare you. I'm not trying to scare you, but this is what they're telling me. And I'm not doing this again. To, to write, I'm not writing no books. And I'm not trying to say, well, if you find, if you want the, the way to, to, to survive 2025, just like, you know, uh, message me and I'll send you my new book and, and videotape about how uh, how you can survive it. Uh, that's private. I'm not, not, I'm not putting it on YouTube. You're going to have to pay for that. <laughs> no, I'm telling you how to survive it. It's real easy. Change your system now. Change your civilization now. Start today. This minute. This second. Change it today. Get ready, and you'll be ready for it by 2025, and you will accept it. If you don't, haha, he's fucking get, pff, what the fuck is, what, pff. I'm telling you, man, it's kind of spooky, but, um, I, I'll, I'll put it, I'll bring it into one of my other videos at one point. Uh, I think I did on one of the other ones, but I'm not sure if anybody was really paying attention to me back then as much. Um, as you get closer to 2025, it's going to be difficult for you. Everything that you guys felt leading up to 2012? That's still going to happen. It's two years before. Remember what you felt by 2010? Uh, by 2012? That's, 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 that's how you're going to feel now. That's why right. I'm, 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 I'm a forecaster of that. So, okay, we're ready about two years before it's going to happen. Okay, I'm feeling it right now. Really crazy. Woo I got to talk, talk about it and tell, tell people about it. Um, remember what you felt? That's how you're going to start feeling now. And it's going to not be easy for you to deal with um, unless you know what's happening and you're prepared for it. And uh, by conscious source of being prepared for it, you have to make the decision to completely and utterly um, change the system now. Wherever you are, get people together, change it now. Make them understand. I don't know. I don't understand. No, like you, won't, you guys weren't prepared in 2012, and you're probably not going to be fully prepared for, for 2025, but if enough star seeds are activated, maybe, maybe, it'll, maybe it'll happen. That's what they're hoping for. Mother Earth and him, 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 he, she, it, and her. <laughs> So, um, uh, good luck. Um, it's you know, it's so. Oh, how do I? How do you know this about the you know the, the Indian culture and the and the, the, that thing? Uh, did you study on? No, I was Mayan for many lifetimes, and I was Hindu for many lifetimes. I was there. I was there for 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 a lot, most of these things. Uh, and I'm, it's not the 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 the, the Mick Jagger song. You know, there was, there was a, you know, uh, you know, it's like he was there because he was Satan. It's like no, no, I wasn't. You know. Uh, you know. Yeah, I was there when the cloud. I was there, right? Because I I I regress back to almost every, basically basically every one of my reincarnated lives, and I've seen every one that I've experienced. It's a lot, <laughs> not to experience, but I can do that as an experience. That's what experiences are, are, are advanced to. Not too many humans can do it because I'm not I'm not a human body, but I'm, my soul is experience. You don't believe that? Yes, no. I don't. You don't believe what's going to happen in 25 is going to be what, what was supposed to happen in 2012, but now you got 13 years uh, as an extension uh, on it, and you're not getting any more extensions, so you better be prepared. Uh, yeah, yeah, you don't want to believe that? Okay. Just that University 2012 never happened. Nothing fucking happened. Nothing gonna happen 25 too. I'm telling you, man. If I had a joke, if I had a joke, if I had a joke, what? 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 What happened? Now? Holy shit, really? You mean there was a disease that almost killed how many of you already? Oof. That was leading up to 2025. I wonder how bad 2025 is going to be. And there's nothing, you, no injection you can take. There's nothing you can do, you know, to be prepared. They're saying if you take this, 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 uh, this, uh, uh, that, this, this I can't say the word. Uh, this shot that that you'll be able to still accept the energy. This guy's selling it, and you can be able to accept the energy. You know that it's coming. No man, it's not about <laughs> your party makeup. It's about the construct of your civilization and how it's how it's. If, if it's not, in other words, if you have a moving part, right, and you got this other moving part, right, you want to fit this moving part into this moving part. It's like if this moving part doesn't match the rest of the moving part, what happens? is You stick this in. It's supposed to go this way, but when this way, but this one goes this way. That. Poof, it pops right out, right? Yeah. So, so, so the same thing with your civilization. Your civilization doesn't work and fit into anything else in this. In this, if you 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 evolving to like this, you know, the Federation goes through space and stuff. They don't want you in space. So what? So you can fucking put Bill McDonald's on them and, and try to profit off each planet you go to. They do not want you in space. That's first of all, number one. Number two, um, they don't want you. As ascended beings anywhere because you can't be ascended beings anywhere because you're still uh, you're still using the lower animal uh, you know planetary survival stuff and that is going to keep you there until uh, did they did they graduate yet no it's like damn 
Okay, well, we tried, right? Yeah, I think it's time to just, uh, you know, yeah, just push the button, man. All of them. All, oh, yeah, it's just not, not even a few. Yeah, a few will, will, will scrabble in, but most of them are just, you know. That's you. So, you got you got two more years. Good um, luck, man. Um, I just told you. I didn't sell you any money for it either. I just told you how to, how to, how to, how to avoid it. And if you think it's too difficult to happen, that's what they want you to believe. Because they got the little spaceship that'll fly them into space, and I mean, they think that that's going to help them, but it's not. It's, it's the they, they say they do it every every civilization that's created. They don't even understand why they're doing it. But you know, but with you all, it's not going to be pretty. And it's all going to be based on you not understanding that the universe doesn't want this 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 thing. You know, into this big machine, and you just think putting in that's going exactly. exactly I, come on, everybody, let's let's. The whole universe needs to create a a, 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 a capitalist, you know, monetary system that we can go on each planet and just take advantage of every every species there and just and just you know, money, 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 money. They don't want that. So like, and if you're not ready to accept what should what 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 the perfection around you is is telling you you should be, then you're gonna be ejected out of here, man. And there ain't no car out there that's going to ever accept anything that's not supposed to be, you know, on, on machinery. You know, machine, you're going to accept anything that's supposed to be the, the way it's supposed to be. And you're not the way you're supposed to be. That's what they're asking me to ask you to tell you. Every day I got I to gotta make one. I can't even like, you know, it's a, oh, why don't you take a break, man? Go, 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 go to the beach or something. Just chill and just watch it. That's not what they're asking me to do. So here I am. It doesn't really matter. At the end of all this, I go back to Arcturus and I'm like, oh my God. And it's, for me up there, it's only been about two, three weeks. For here, it's been like for a whole fucking lifetime. 58 fucking years I'm down here. And I'm, the body's like fucking enough. The, the, the soul's like, yeah. come on, you'll make it. Try it this time. Maybe this time it'll work and they'll survive what's about to come. So, um, good luck, guys. Because you know, you need to be, you need to, you guys need to be in another place, uh, you know, another, another place, so then, so then, so then, you know, not, not, you know, a place so that you know we can continue bringing souls in here. That, that then, well, right now it's like you know, how many of you, eight billion souls stuck on this fucking planet? It should be a, a million, two billion, two billion at the most, billion at the most, man. Eight billion souls stuck on this planet. You know why? Because not nobody's graduating. Nobody's graduating. Nobody's graduating. Get it? No matter what you think you were doing, you're not. If I'm not, not. You're just coming back at the same thing. And you keep on doing the same things for the wealth class that they want you to do because they want to, they want to ride you into hell. Because that's their, that's their job, right? As, uh, as, um, what do you, call, you know, in, in, in your, your, your Catholic terms, you would call them, you know, uh, demons, you know, yeah, you know, like, you know, uh, you know, products of Satan and stuff. In, in the space world, you call them interstellar beings that are parasites that would come in through other dimensions and, like, you know, suck the fucking life out of you, which is what they're doing to the civilization. All way, all by way of money. And you're not going to be prepared for it. They don't give a shit if you're prepared for it. That's why they give you, you know, whatever, I'm not going to say it. But that's why the things happen that happen... The, th the things that have happened to you in the last 10 years, about the, <laughs> so 11 years, those things that have happened to you have happened to you for a reason, for, for guided by something to keep you stupid and keep you not aware that you should have taken that energy from 2012 and built it up into a place where you were ready for 2020, 2025, and you're not. You are not. I, I, don't, I don't know what else to say, man. I've said this so many fucking times. I don't, I don't, it's, it's, it's tiring to be to know to know this stuff, and and to to, to hear to hear and then and then and then, and hear complete criticism from you or complete like, what is he doing, man? Is he think yeah? Is he trying to sell a book or something? So, um, good luck with that. I don't understand. Om Namah Shivaya. Om Namah Shivaya. <laughs> Om Namah Shivaya. Om Namah Shivaya. <laughs> Om Namah Shivaya. You choose. Hmm? You want 
Shiva the world destroyer, creator, or do you want Shiva the, the master sender? Whichever one you want will come. If you want the, the, the mass ascender and you're still fucking doing the things that you're still doing as a civilization to each other as human beings, then no. The other one will come. Because the universe doesn't want you there. The creator doesn't want you, wanted you to be ready for it. And they say, well, Mother Earth says either get either either they stop now or get them the fuck off of me. And Shiva, whatever your energy you call down, and it's not like you, you pray to Shiva, Shiva, good Shiva come down, good Shiva come down, and then, and then you expect that to happen, while you're still like, you know, profiting and taking advantage of and whatever else, caste system, you know, enslaving an entire civilization, and, 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 and all, all, all slaves going like, yes, okay, well, what are we going to do? It's like, just stop, stop. He's not going to come down and go back up. Okay, mass ascending to where? To some place that, that's exactly like this? And there is no place exactly like this, so except it would be a hell. But even that doesn't, isn't, isn't, isn't you know, what's happened waiting for years is. Goodbye, souls. So, uh, mass ascension. So, um, you go, Shiva? <laughs> the mass ascender ascends. Billions of souls all at once just because you're ready for it. Or well, the mass destroyer that says enough. Both the universe, your mother earth, and this time even the creator saying enough is enough. And then Shiva does <laughs> his most... Uh, uh, <laughs> destructive and you know and he doesn't like doing that one he likes doing the other one but it seems that your civilizations before you I mean, everything's created based on your 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 prototype ends up doing the same thing so good luck with that hope this time is different Om Namah Shivaya Om Namah Shivaya Om Namah Shivaya Hare Hare Om Shanti. Because of Shiva and the Shetki. Do you want Shiva the destroyer? <laughs> Shetki. The provider. The, the nurturer. You decide. Om Namah Shivaya. Om Namah Shivaya.